Hello guys, welcome back to Ray's Gaming Tech Productions and today I will be showing you guys how to avoid the encoding overloaded message in OBS Studios. Now this message is normally caused by your CPU simply not having enough room to work smoothly with OBS Studios which causes your recording to lag and no one likes that. Now this video will consist of two easy methods of fixing this issue which for me has completely wiped this issue away. Now the first method of the video is setting your OBS priority to high. Now doing this will force your OBS to always get prioritized first no matter what needs your CPU more, which causes your OBS to rarely get overloaded. Now one problem you will notice is that doing this will cause your games to perform worse because it won't get as much CPU as OBS is getting but if your PC is somewhat decent you really wouldn't notice. Now all you need to do is go down here to settings and you want to go to advanced. Now, if you look up here at general, you'll see process priority and all you need to do is set it to high. Now, above normal is decent, but don't set it to normal because that is where things will start getting bad. Below normal is even worse and idle. I'm not sure what that would do, but seeing how it's under normal, that really wouldn't do good either. But all you want to do is set it to either above normal or high. If you feel that high is causing your games to lag a little too much, you can set it to above normal. But yeah, just set it to high or above normal and not normal, not below normal or idle. And yeah, once you do that, all your games will lose some CPU usage, but your OBS will get the majority of it because of course you do not want your OBS to lag. The second and last method is setting your CPU usage preset to the highest possible settings. Now doing this will take a lot more load off of OBS which will cause your OBS to not become overloaded. Now all you need to do is go into your settings, go to output, go to recording and make sure that your output mode is on advanced and once you do that go down to encoder settings and you should see CPU usage preset higher equals less CPU which is exactly what this is. The higher it is which means ultra fast is the highest that will cause for your CPU to not be used at like practically at all. I mean, of course it will be used, but it won't be used as much as super fast, very fast, faster, fast, medium, slow, slower, very slow, or placebo. Now, you wanna make sure that you set this at ultra fast because again, like I said, it will take a lot of load off of your CPU. And if you even set your process priority to high, this those two together will basically cause your OBS to never become overloaded. And to be honest, ever since I did these two things, I have never had to worry about my OBS overloading. And as you guys can see in my game recordings, I've even been able to turn up my games and not have to worry about anything. Like, for instance, my killer frequency video was at the highest settings and OBS wasn't lagging at all, but that's also because killer frequency was also extremely optimized. So it all really depends on what game you're playing, how high your settings are in that game, and what you have your settings as in OBS. But yeah, other than that, just make sure that you have your CPU usage preset all the way at the highest and make sure that your process priority is, is at high and if you feel that the CPU usage preset can be set lower or if you feel that your process priority can be set lower you can do that but personally for me this has worked for me and i haven't had to worry about anything